you like to win a PS5 bundle? We'll check the link in the description for your chance at one. And now, welcome to another one of my videos. You can help support this channel by subscribing and liking, and by grabbing some of my free ebooks and audiobooks. Today I'm promoting Shades of Grey, an apocalyptic science fiction series, and Monster of Monsters, a sci-fi horror. You can read or listen to the first two stories of both these series for free. I left the link in the description, and later on there'll be one in the upper right hand corner. And now to this live stream. This live stream is just a companion to a video I just finished, and I forgot to actually open all the cultist high priest bags that I collected, so that's what this video is going to be. I'm going to go through them and open them up. Now, I don't think, like, the Spooky Scorch and uh, the Treasure Hunters... Actually, I think it's just the Treasure Hunters. There, I don't think there's a different level for them. I think they're all just one, so let's see. So, Cult, I got 13 of them to open. Let me just check. I think they're just one type of bag, no matter if you get it off of a one or two star or three star. So, yeah. So, let's just go ahead and start opening. We're also going to pay attention to the sound. Now, this one actually gave me the helmet and the clothes. So that was pretty good. It gave me a regular Mothman egg. And let's see if there's anything else notable. Looks to be it. Now to me, the sound was exactly like the first one. So... And if you were, if you happen to have not seen the previous video where I walked around for about an hour hunting all these called the High Priests, you do get at least one legendary item every time you take one out. So they are kind of worth going to hunt, and they only come out during the Mothman Equinox. So yeah, I think it's a two-week event. I need to double check. I don't think any plans ever come with these. It's too bad. I think they that would be a great thing that they should add maybe in the future to these. And they're called packs. I call them bags. Cultist High Priest packs. I'll need to change that. It's like I did grab another set of clothes. So that would be probably one thing that you're after. Is that, oh, and there's the perfect Mothman egg. Now I'm going to have to go and check out uh, Mothman Equinox event and try to put that perfect Mothman egg. Excuse me. I think it's supposed to be in some sort of cradle that's at the event. I haven't done this yet. And what I understand, it basically will replace the vengeful Mothman that's supposed to come during the defense part of the event. And... It'll be Mothman hatchlings or something, so I just thought it might be cool to go check it out. That one gave me quite a few of the eggs. So at least I have one perfect egg, which that's what I was after, because I want to really go see what the difference is in the event, if anything, notably. I thought it said... Uh, the perfect Mothman egg is a 5% chance, so that was, I, I did good. Just to be able to have grabbed one. I also would suggest not opening these very quickly. I have had issues with the other types of pails and goodie bags. Um, actually disappearing because I tried to open them too fast. That would be my only suggestion with these. Alright, looks like I got about uh, two more. Another Mothman egg. I've already dropped two videos tonight, so I will probably come back tomorrow night and try to uh, do the Mothman event and use that one perfect Mothman egg I was able to grab. 
and do a, vid a whole video on the event and just the difference, maybe run around and try to get video instead of actually taking out the enemy. So that's not too bad. Let's see, would it be under, see if I can find it now. It's, uh, was it perfect? So we'll look under P and M. That's miscellaneous, don't see it. Let's try food. Hopefully it doesn't spoil. Ah, there it is. Oh, it does. Ah, so yeah, I'm definitely going to end this recording and not play anymore tonight because I want this to last. I do have the card good with salt, so that'll help. It's 90% less slower uh, spoilage. But yeah. So if you've been looking for it, it's under P in the food category, under items in your pit boy. And yeah, 13 bags, and I only was able to snag one. All right, that's it for this video. Go check out, I I thought I was, yeah, I thought the cultist high priest would be harder to find than like the spooky scorch and the treasure hunters, but I actually did really good. So I encourage you to go check out my previous video I just dropped before this one. It is an hour long, but yeah, just watch the first yeah, 10, 15 minutes. Sometimes I was finding, I think my first location, there ended up being three cultists just in that one location. So yeah, I do cover a couple hot spots that you can go check out to try to find your own cultist high priest. And if you enjoyed this uh, cultist high priest package opening, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions, throw them in the comments. And that's it here. Uh, happy gaming. Got about, I think, two weeks for the event. So go find those cultist high priests and go uh, do the Mothman Equinox event that's on the hour every hour. Check you guys later.